As you all know, I put a hitch on the John Deere there a few uh, years ago there, maybe a month or so, or maybe, I don't know, six months or whatever it was ago there. I mean, they put something heavy on the old Deere, she just wants to bend down because there's not much reinforcement back here for anything. You know, like to reinforce this is going to be a pain in the ass. And I can only turn this sharp with a trailer anyways. So I got an idea that you might want to see. So what I did is I cut a piece of square tubing like this right here. And I'm going to put it across here like this and then make some brackets up to my bagger. Because that way I can still do what I need to do when I need to do it. If you know what I'm saying. Hopefully you guys can agree with me. And if you can't, then hey, I don't really give a shit to be honest with you. You know what I'm saying? This is my deal, not your deal. This is how I roll, not you roll. You can roll how you want to roll. I'm going to roll like this. I'm going to roll it. Roll the dice and see what we can't figure out together. So tighten this up that's not going to stay on there at all. And then we can kind of get our angles of the dangles. So that's not bad there. That's not bad there. So we just got to make sure she's in the right place at the right time here. Which is right about... I'm going to go by the eyeball because that's what I do. The eyeball judgment. It's always the best. But I got to back my truck out and get the welder out here. Oh, watch out for the Blue Lagoon. El Blue El Laguno. What the hell's going on here i wonder all right okay yep looks good all right okay yep all right could be give it out a tap oh that was closed fuck never leave your fucking door open that would have sucked to put the door right into her yeah she's not starting we uh we got something going on here, Jim. Something going on here, Captain. Well, here, here's one way to check it. Slap a little bit of this down its throat. Just a little. Oh, I said a little. Have an eye there, boss. Okay, so it's not a fuel delivery yet. Now we're on the spark. Spark will lead her. Pad coil, give the coil a tap, see what that does. Right. Okay, nope. Check for spark. I was only joking, truck. I'm not gonna sell you for God's sakes. Let me grab a spark plug. That's the easiest way. Should have some here somewhere. Where did I put my extra spark plugs? Fuck, they gotta be here. Oh, come on. To be continued. When I find the goddamn spark plug. Well, I didn't bother coming back to the truck. She's got no spark, so. We're gonna have to get a coil for her and go from there. But let's get back to this lawnmower because that's what I need done. Because, you know, it's tractor pull weekend. Ivan's bringing out his tent trailer tonight. I gotta pull that thing to the backyard. So we gotta get this thing done. This is the most important project today. The truck, you can figure that out any day. Not like I drive much. See, I jinxed myself. I told somebody I was gonna sell it today. It's mad at me now. It knows. Just like Ben next door knows when I'm doing a video. You always know when Bill Dirty Old Bill is doing a video, Ben starts his lawnmower up, right, Ben? How you doing, bud? Love ya. Pretty great, dude. Just fuck with you, bud. How about it, Captain? Dirty, rotten, old, stinky old Ben Ruski. All right, slap that on there. You always weld in Crocs, T-shirt, and shorts. So that's really the only way to weld, to be honest with you. There's no other way. How do you tell you? Remember, Crocs, T-shirts, and shorts. Okay, how's it go? Okay. 
Two tacks for us. You fucking moved, didn't you? Fucking right, you moved. That thing moved while it was in the garage. You know what? That's good. Fuck it. Okay, that looks absolutely shitty, but I like it. Jimmy Buffett Wells right there, John. So now what we gotta do, we gotta cut a piece of this right here. We need it to be seven and a half inches. Okay. Always wear your face shield. Safety always first at Dirty Old Bilson's. I'm gonna cut a little bit of that off so it looks the same on both sides. I can't take it. Just like that. There you go, good enough. Always make sure you weld around a gas tank too. Just so you know, I forget how you mentioned that. Not the best looking welds, but good enough for what we need. There you go, good enough. Now you can probably stand on that. Oh yeah, that ain't going anywhere now. Greg, no. We can go tractor pulling with that thing. Well, there you go, this is just a short little video. I like giving you a short one. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification. That'll do it.